Hi guys, I'm editing this video and the reason you're seeing this at the beginning is because I didn't do an intro. In my defense, I was filming a bunch of videos on this day and just forgot the intro for this one. So this is going to be a what I eat in a day. I am trying to eat more protein because I want to build muscle and that's kind of what you need to do. And I am dairy free. Hoping this video will give you guys some recipe ideas if you are dairy free and looking to get more protein. If you're new here, hi my name's Emma. I post college vlogs, morning routines, productive vlogs, lifestyle videos, all that stuff. So if you like that, hit the subscribe button. I post videos every Sunday and occasionally on Wednesdays. Let's just get into the video. So for breakfast, I'm going to be having bagels. These are not my favorite bagels, but I have not been able to find the ones that I like. So for these bagels, the ones that I like had like 9 or 10 grams of protein. These have 11. And then I use the Kite Hill cream cheese. Can you tell I like silk milk? <laughs> Why do we have three of them? Oh, and then we got the silk creamer. Casually just a watermelon sitting here. It's my favorite cup. If you're wondering, this is the creamer I use. Oh, we love that. It's because I was looking at the camera. If you're looking for a way to get even more protein in your coffee, might I recommend one of the three gallons I have in my, not gallons, whatever. Three containers I have in my fridge of the Silk protein milk. You can use that instead of creamer. I think they have a vanilla version too. I just get unsweetened because I use it in my cereal. Can't get over this factory made cream cheese. Look how beautiful that looks. Ow. Okay, so I'm gonna eat this and then I will pick up the camera again when I'm actually eating something else. Also, I did just want to put a little disclaimer in this video. Because it is a what I eat in a day, it doesn't mean that you have to eat this way too. And I'm not saying that you should. And I'm just here to give you ideas. I listen to my body. Yeah, I eat what I want. When I want, you may be different. Hi, okay, so I just did a workout. What I really love to have after a workout, because I don't have protein powder here, is the Silk Ultra Chocolate Milk. It's 20 grams of protein for just a cup, 8 ounces, and if you're vegan, chances are that you might lack the vitamin B12, which is found in a lot of meat. And just this one cup is 130% of your daily need of vitamin B12. Also for lunch, I'm having bread with some almond butter. Ah, oh, okay, the bananas aren't ripe yet, but my favorite thing to have after a workout or just lunch in general is bread with almond butter, bananas, hemp seeds on top with cinnamon and honey. But instead, because the bananas are still a little greener than I would like. So I also have these, they're Vans waffles. They have the power grain kind. I didn't buy that one, they didn't have it. But that is 10 grams protein for two waffles. These are just the whole grain. It's five grams protein for two waffles. And I just pair them with some organic blueberries. One other option if you are vegan, garden in crispy tenders. The chicken nuggets don't have an air fry setting, but I found if you do 400 for 15 minutes and flip halfway through, it's perfect. So here's the chicken nuggets, marinara sauce, super good. And I'm gonna have my chocolate milk. So I'm still hungry. I am making waffles now for no other reason than it's just convenient and I'm lazy. You know, you just put it in and push it down. That's it. And then I got some blueberries and maple syrup. It's the maple syrup from Costco. Okay, so I'm gonna have dinner and I'm in this predicament. Do I have leftovers or do I make like a veggie burger or something? I have this tempeh stir fry, which I had last night for dinner. If you want like vegan Chinese food, I will leave that recipe down below. So the avocado needs to be eaten today, but I will still link the tempeh stir fry in the description. It's pretty good, especially if you like, um... Okay. 
I almost couldn't find them and I thought I was gonna have another one of those situations where like with the bananas where I wanted something and I couldn't have it. I found them. This is what I get. It's the Dr. Prager's All-American 22 grams plant-based burger. There's only like two in that box, which is really annoying. Rant for another day. <laughs> And I'll just let that heat up and I like to put a lid on it because it's frozen and I want it to cook all the way. This is seriously as lazy and as realistic as it's gonna get. And I don't like to cook. I wish I did. I like baking things. I have cupcakes, which we're totally gonna eat those later, by the way. Like that tempeh stir fry thing. I hated making that. It took like an hour, which is probably a normal cooking time. But for me, it's not something you can just take out of a package. I never called myself healthy, I'll just say that. With the tempeh stir fry thing, you have to do everything. And it says it takes 20 minutes to do it. It took me like an hour, but that's also because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not like avoiding carbohydrates or anything like that, but we don't have any hamburger buns. So I just have this patty with avocado. <laughs> I mean, it kind of looks like a vegan steak if you go like up close. A chocolate cupcake to end the night. What a perfect way. It's so good. After the cupcakes, I didn't have anything. It is 10 p.m. now, and I'm gonna go to bed. So, I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up so I know, and subscribe if you're not already. I post videos for sure every Sunday, and hopefully next Wednesday. Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.